Hey, what's up guys? Shinman Tagzo here. Thank you so much for tuning in. Welcome back to another video. So, there's been a lot of item changes in the advanced server. And anything in the advanced server comes through to the original server eventually, right? So, I think it's really important that we talk about these items. But I won't be talking about all of the item changes in one video. We're gonna focus on checking them out piece by piece or maybe two or three per video. In this video, we're gonna talk about two items that will give you an extra skill you heard me right usually your hero gets three skills right now they made some changes on some familiar items and if you buy these two items once they're patched out or once they're implemented in the original server you get an additional skill so in this video we're, we'll check out these skills that i'm talking about that they give you let's talk about courage bulwark first so it has a new passive now aside from increasing the attack power and defense of nearby allies around you it has this additional passive called heavy armor this passive gives you an extra button on the right side of your screen as you can see here and if you activate that or if you press that you will raise the movement speed of your hero and everyone around you or every hero around you by 30% this lasts for three seconds so it's a really good engage spell and it can also save your teammates for example they're trying to run away they're low on hp but the enemy hero that's chasing them is really fast so you can get close to that ally pop the skill instantly giving that ally 30 percent more movement speed aside from that this also raises the physical and magic damage of everyone affected by 20 percent that is a lot so courage bulwark definitely is a really good team fight item now especially since it affects multiple heroes your entire team everyone around you but again it only lasts for three seconds so the timing of using this skill or this item skill is essential use it to chase enemies use it to run away from enemies and also use it to boost everyone's damage in team fights so the next item that can give you a fourth skill or an extra skill is winter truncheon so nobody uses this right now in the original server but once this patch rolls out i'm sure everyone would be using it especially mages so it gives you nice stats right magic power armor and now it gives you hp but they remove the old skill and they replace it with this new one this button or this additional skill when you buy winter's truncheon makes you immune to any damage at all basic attacks skills magics and it lasts for two seconds but the drawback here is you are not going to be able to move for that duration our turret is under attack So why is this item so good? It prevents assassins from assassinating you or surprising you. You can panic press this button and it will prevent you from taking any damage in the next 2 seconds. And if you're using any type of mage that dives in like Alice or Harley, you can dive in, surprise enemies and if they start focusing you, press this item skill and you'll be safe for the next 2 seconds allowing your teammates to back you up. It is also best to use this while waiting for your escape skill to cool down, like if you're trying to escape and your dash skill has one or two second cooldown left before you can use it pop this skill not take any damage and then get out of there okay so before i end this video what if we buy these two items at the same time like in one hero so we have winter's truncheon right now and we're gonna buy courage bulwark fear is a weapon okay so that's pretty weird so it seems that you can't have more than one item that has this active skill. The one that you currently have will just get overwritten by the next item that you'll buy. So that kind of sucks because they could have just put this skill button on a different area like on top of skill 2 or skill 1 so that you can have like two items both with active skills that you can use. So that's it for these kinds of items. I'm pretty excited about other items that they might put into the game with similar uh skill buttons or allowing you to have an extra skill these types of items will drastically change how team fights go and will allow players to do more awesome outplays that'll be fun for everyone to watch so that's it for this video what do you think of this update please leave a comment down below and if you enjoyed the video leave a like and subscribe for more in the future my name is shinman Takazo. thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video peace